coach, it's obviously been a weird, uh, weird uh, couple of weeks with the uh, storm knocking everybody out of practice and everything. But have your kids kind of weathered that? No pun intended. And yeah, yeah, I uh, see Coach Miller walking by here. We were talking just the other day about you know I've been doing this for 21 years and I think for 19 of those years uh, never saw anything like what we've seen the last you know two or three years going back to I guess three years ago we're up at Clint up at um, Clover and I end up playing a football game that finished up at about one o'clock in the morning with a three hour drive back home um, and then last year of course the flood and this year the hurricane and pushing everything back and it's just. You know, it just uh, goes to show you that uh, no matter how much we think we are, we're not in control. So, um, but we're here, and uh, we've had a good day of practice yesterday, and hopefully mm-hmm. we'll get out here today and get after it again and get a little better. Playing the number one team in the state, uh, Dutch Fork, obviously very talented team. Just tell them, give me a little preview of this one. Well, I told you guys yesterday. You know, uh, life is full of opportunities, and how you uh, deal with those opportunities is kind of what makes your mark in life and um, that's all this is it's an opportunity for our guys to go and play a really good football team at their place on their homecoming and, um, and hopefully leave a mark on uh, on their record you know and uh, so we're excited about the opportunity and uh, the kids were super excited we flew around real well yesterday and um, just excited about getting a chance to go play the number one team today. I know that a couple of their wide receivers Connor and Irby get a lot of attention uh, the tailback but uh you believe the real strength of that team is in the trenches, right? Oh, absolutely. Their offensive line, Jacob. Their uh, their offensive line is huge. Uh, they average about 290 pounds on the offensive line, 285, 290 somewhere there. A uh, bunch of seniors, um, experienced guys, you know, uh, and they do a great job coaching them. And uh, we've got a total defensive line, our linebackers. We've got our work cut out for us for sure. Um, with trying to be able to stop the run, but at the same time, they can stand up and throw it anytime they want to. So. Uh, they got three college football players playing receiver for him, and quarterback has looked uh, really, really good as well for him not to have played last year. So they're loaded, you know, and uh, we're we're just got to be up to the challenge. All right, Coach. Best of luck to you on Friday, and we'll talk to you next week. All right, sounds good. Thanks, Richard.